To be able to use the entertainment system, the front TV, you need to have first the generator running, and more important than that, you need to be able to find the remote control, which is the one that you see right now. Now, to be able to use the TV, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to turn the TV on. It will take a few seconds for the TV to start. As you see, it will start with the Roku TV. All the TVs in our units are smart TVs, or they're connected to a smart DVD Blu-ray player. The idea is that if you actually are in a place in which you have Wi-Fi available, either by a, a Wi-Fi local in the area that you're at, or even if you're using a hotspot on your cell phone, you can actually do video streaming on the TV or the Blu-ray player directly. Keep in mind, laws do not allow for a TV to be on while you're driving if it's inside of the driver. So if the driver can see the TV, the TV should be off while you're driving. As you see, this is the TV with a Roku system. Now, once you actually go and turn on the TV, there are several different things you can do, but before you can actually watch TV, air TV, you need to reset the channels. Uh, most of the digital TV channels change from one area to the other, so you need to actually rescan for them. To rescan the channels, this is what you do. You go to antenna. You press the star button and you say scan for channels or scan again for channels. It will ask you if you want to start finding channels. You're going to click OK. And you do not need channels 3 and 4. At this point, the TV will start searching the channels. Now, to be able to get more reception, uh, you may want to make sure that you have the amplifier in the back of the TV on. That is something that is normally on. If you do happen to move the antenna, to raise the antenna, and I'm going to show you the antenna right now. That's the antenna. If you do raise the antenna, be aware that the antenna should never be up when you're driving. If you do that, you will do cause severe damage to the roof, and that is not covered by the insurance. So if you do happen to use the antenna, please keep that in mind. As you see, the TV keeps searching for channels. Also, you do have the remote control for the Blu-ray player, DVD player. In this case, you can see it right by the TV. For example, is the one that just opened. So it will be right there by the TV. Once you're done with this, you can actually watch all the channels that are in the digital service for that particular area. In our case, we already had them searched. So as you see, we can see the local TV channels.